Today we are going to read the story of baby Jesus by Alice Joyce Davidson. A little girl named Alice was as busy as can be. She helped make decorations for a big tall Christmas tree. On Christmas Eve she went to church, wrapped gifts for everyone, then picked up her Bible storybook when all the work was done. She opened up her book to read about the Christmas story so that she could understand its wonder and its glory. On a slightly open window, Alice heard a rap tap tap. The airmail bird flew in and left this letter on her lap. Reading is the magic key to take you where you want to be. The Bible story book became a great big open screen. Alice walked on through to Bible land and came upon the scene. She saw a woman, Mary, whose face was very fair, nearing Bethlehem with Joseph to pay a great tax there. Mary was going to have a baby, perhaps that very night, but Bethlehem was crowded with not a room in sight. Mary looked so tired that an innkeeper felt pity and offered them his stable, the last room in the city. Not far away, some shepherds looked in fear up at the skies. They saw an angel coming down. His bright light filled their eyes. Don't be afraid, the angel said, for I bring you news of joy. Tonight in Bethlehem was born a holy baby boy. He's Christ the Lord, a savior. He'll save people everywhere. He's sleeping in a manger. You'll find him lying there. Suddenly the angel was joined by many more. The angel sang a song of praise to God whom they adore. Glory to our Father, to God who reigns above. Peace on earth, goodwill to all. God sends his gift of love. The angels finished singing their praise-filled song, and then they rose up through the star-filled sky to heaven once again. Let's hurry on to Bethlehem, the shepherds cried with joy. They hastened through the starry night to see this holy boy. When the shepherds reached the stable, they saw a wondrous sight, for Mary's little baby had been born that very night. There in that humble stable among the oxen and the sheep, as his mother watched in wonder, the Son of God lay fast asleep. The shepherds knelt in wonder to see this miracle of birth. It was as the angel told them, God had sent his love to earth. Mary called her baby Jesus, and with a mother's tender touch, she wrapped a little blanket round this child she loved so much. The shepherds spread the joyous news about the Savior's birth and how this child would come to change the world, bringing love to the earth. Now in the east, a bright new star shone both night and morn. Three wise men who had seen the star knew the king was born. They wanted to adore him, so traveled from afar. They knew that they would find the king by following the star. The star brought them to Bethlehem. It stopped above the door. Inside they found the baby they had wanted to adore. The wise men fell upon their knees before the newborn king and being there with Jesus caused their happy hearts to sing. The men gave Jesus special gifts and stood up to depart. And all these things that happened, Mary treasured in her heart. Now the time had come for Alice to walk back through her screen. She tiptoed home from Bible land and thought of what she had seen. Alice thought about the shepherds and the star that shone above. She thought about the wise men and God's wondrous gift of love. 
Alice thought about the newborn king and the angel song of glory and found she knew the meaning of the wondrous Christmas story. On Christmas morn, when Alice woke, she raced down to the tree and sang this special song of praise for all her family. Glory to our God on high, glory to our King. Praise him like the angels, let our happy voices ring. Glory to our God above, who so loved everyone. He gave the world a gift of love, Jesus Christ, his son. Glory to our God of love this joyous Christmas morn and happy birthday, Jesus, on this day that you were born. Have a very merry Christmas and remember the real reason for the season and celebrate the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Bye.